What's up guys? This is Square2448 with a farming simulator 2017 Let's Play video and today we will be harvesting canola, plowing some fields, and doing some odd jobs for other farmers. We'll be starting out today by hopping in our case harvester and heading right next to us to the field to harvest the canola which we did seed in the previous Let's Play video. We'll uh, start this old harvester up, which it still does a very good job, even though it is a starter equipment. And we'll be doing a few passes here, then we do have to run over to the store, where we will be leasing a plow for us to plow out these fields, since they need to be plowed. And uh, going to be a very fun video today, and if you guys would like to see more Let's Play series videos here on weekends, Give me a big like and let me know guys on what we should do for the next Let's Play series video. And we'll be doing a few passes here and then, like I said, we'll be switching in between running the grain cart and going on over to the store. We do need to pick up a plow for us to plow out all our fields since we really do need to uh, do that before we seed them again. And we will also be doing some work. For the farmer at field 16 to lower the uh, cost of that field which is a very cool feature that you could do you could do a lot of work for the farmer and then he will drop the price for you since you built a good relationship with them which is very cool so we will definitely do that because we do need to drop the prices for everything since we do not have much money but let me know in the comments guys if we should take out a two hundred thousand dollar loan and then we will pay it back once we become a really large farm and have the funds to pay it back. So let me know guys if that sounds like a very good idea and uh, we'll do a few more passes and then we'll head on into the town. But we do, we'll uh, set this for the worker to hire and that way our worker can do that. We do need to start up the grain cart which I believe is attached to the case tractor here but we will be taking this uh, case on over to the store to uh, pick it up because it has a front weight and then we don't need to buy one but we I do want to wash it that way when we go to the store we have a nice clean tractor and it doesn't look like we don't take care of our equipment since we'll probably trade these into the store later on in the future so uh, we'll go along next to him and uh, we are a one man farm today which is a uh, pretty cool really do enjoy doing these farming videos for you guys and this is a very highly requested video I get a lot of requests to do let's play series and I really do enjoy doing these a lot so like I said give me a big like on this and I think that we will start to branch into the cows in the next video since I think we'll have a lot more money with the loan we'll I'll pull this on over to the side we'll park this here and we will walk on over but actually we will first buy our pressure washer and this did go up in price from FS15 and a lot of the things in FS17 did go up and you have to pay more for it but we'll go on over here we'll put it right next to our shop that way we could do that we'll switch on over and uh, that's easier than walking that way and it's quicker we'll start we just need to wash this tractor but I think we'll wash everything now that way it's all clearing for us and like I said let's play series videos are on Sunday and it's the second video usually that day and I will possibly be doing more throughout the week but uh, let's get this clean that way the uh, sales people at the dealership see that we take care of our equipment and don't see that it's full of dirt and then uh, they will give us more money since you get more money when trading in at the store instead of just selling it from the uh, portable store on our phones which is pretty cool we'll do this and we also do, do need to cultivate after we plow so we have plenty of work to do today but I would like to do some work for the farmer also to help us out with getting some income and like I said lowering the price of the fields we'll hop on back here We'll do this cultivator and I actually would like to get the other cultivator but we have other plans for other equipment so uh, we will definitely uh, 
get a cultivator last since we really do need a new harvester and I would say some other new equipment. We'll head on over to the store now and I pick up the least plow. Arriving here at the dealership parking lot and uh, we will be go walking on over and we will be leasing the plow and I think we'll go for the smallest plow or the one above it but let's see how much it is to lease. We'll go on over to the plow section and there you have a lot of different equipment but we only came here for a plow and if we were that looks like a very small plow and this one a little bit more money but like I said we won't be purchasing it we will be leasing it so $1,650 to lease sounds like a deal to me and this is a very necessary piece for us to have just to get us to the next seating and we do have some seed pallets here so uh, let me know guys what should we do should we uh customize this tractor to have the uh, front loader attachment and then we purchase a small trailer let me know in the comments guys because we really need to find a way for us to get those seed pallets on over to the farm but we will make our way back on over to the farm and we will probably empty out our workers harvester and then we'll do some plowing pulling into the farm now and like I said we will be unloading the worker because I believe he is close to being full since uh, he's still going so we will leave our tractor here we will keep it running and we'll hop in the grain cart actually we need to stop him really fast before he turns around because uh, we do not want to uh, go through the uh, grain which is uh, not realistic so we stopped him in a perfect time we will uh, make this turn yep look at that very close there but there is a great demand for this grain but I don't think we'll get too much money for it so I think once we're done with this whole harvest we will make our way on over there because I really would like to get some money since there's a great demand but if we aren't gonna make too much then we won't leave it uh, for right now and we'll do it another time we'll get the worker back on his job of getting this done halfway done here and uh, we will probably do uh, actually a little bit ourselves before we switch on over and we'll probably start with the field up there to the left it's over there it does need some plowing so we will definitely be doing that and also we will possibly be going in helping out some other farmers but look at this guys this is a great combine for a starter piece of uh, equipment here on the farm and like I said we do need to uh, get some new equipment so I think the, a loan will greatly help us out we'll uh, hop out of that we'll make our way on over to our tractor over here that has the plow and we did keep it running which uses up some diesel but I think we'll be fine make our way on over and I can't wait to be doing some plowing this is the first time that we will be plowing some fields here and we do have a lease I believe the lease said 24 hours hopefully we don't go above that but I will definitely check that out also pretty soon that way we don't do anything uh, bad and get a fine we do not need to pay any fines so uh, we will start plowing here and they're very realistic how this plow works look at those awesome textures down there flipping the uh, dirt over and then you have the dust from the dry dirt and we will also need to fertilize for the next harvest to help us get even more money and uh, like I said our goal is to make as much money on this farm to help us out so uh, we will continue here and this plow is small but it does the job just that I will probably finish the rest of this off camera but uh, look at that guys we did turn narrow but I will stop it and lift it up we do not need to be ripping up the grass around this that wouldn't be too good guys we need to keep a very nice good uh, border of grass that way it looks nice for any uh, future farmers that purchase these fields from us and I think that will be pretty cool if we could sell these fields to people if we don't want them that would be awesome but I don't think we could do that 
but plowing is underway here and it's going pretty well so I think we'll probably switch on over to the harvester do a little bit of that in a few passes here and then we will be calling it a day but like I said if you guys would like me to do some cows or sheep let me know in the comments or we could even do pigs I think we will try out the pigs since that is new to the game and I really want to try that out that will be very cool to do here and since we are on a dirt road we can turn around since it's our farm dirt road and it's not like a main street area where a bunch of traffic is which is also a pretty bad thing turning around that way we would actually have to outline a border around this but I don't think we have to do that here so we will continue here this is going very well and it's actually getting pretty dirty look at that already getting pretty dirty that's pretty funny also though but pretty realistic at the same time and I really do like how realism we could be in this game and a lot of you guys really do enjoy the realism I bring into all these videos and I thank you for that because it's a lot of fun making videos for you guys and I really do overall enjoy it and a lot of you guys enjoy watching these great high quality content videos here on the channel we'll uh, hire this worker oh I turned it off I meant to hire the worker that's pretty funny we will actually switch on over to the harvester so I hope you guys enjoyed let me know in the comments what you guys thought about this thanks for watching and remember to subscribe